we're here in the streets of Old Milwaukee. To recount a centuries-old tradition that is still recognized today, holiday gift giving. Over thousands of years, gifts have been given to tie people together in obligation, appreciation, and remembrance, and in very practical ways with very practical objects. And the place in Milwaukee in the late 19th century to do that was at T.A. Chapman's. T.A. Chapman's was known as the premier department store in Milwaukee. It came to be known as the palace store and the wonder and pride of the whole Northwest. It serviced Milwaukee with the finest of goods and the best service available. Children would often receive gifts for the holidays like this donkey cart pull toy. The idea behind toys like these was to teach children motor development skills. This toy, dating to 1917, was lovingly played with by a local Milwaukee girl. Toy trains were made around 1891. Most of the earliest trains were pull toys, later becoming electric toy trains that were incredibly beautifully detailed. This Markland toy stove is a very special example of a fully functioning gas stove. It could be hooked up to the home gas line, allowing a child to actually cook on the stove. Back in the 19th century, anything that was high-tech or made life easier or work faster was a very welcome piece of equipment. An example of a very practical gift would be this toaster. It could toast four pieces of bread at a time and would be placed over a burner on a coal or wood-fired stove. The carpet beater is a very practical device. The average carpet was a small piece of textile and could be taken outside and beaten with the carpet beater. Some gifts were given just to show appreciation as well as mark status. The stunning 97 carat quartz pendant with rubies and emeralds would have been a very cherished gift by the woman who received it. She would have worn it for special occasions such as a trip to the opera or to the theater. Similarly, a man would have loved to have a Elgin National Watch Company Hunter Case watch. It's the kind of thing that he could use as a showpiece as he was out on the town or visiting friends. Loved ones would also give very sentimental gifts. Our handsome hair watch chain and this beautiful tortoiseshell comb hearken to the story The Gift of the Magi, published in 1905 by American author O. Henry. In the short story, a young American couple living in New York City don't have a lot of money to spend on gifts for each other for Christmas but they each own something precious. She, her hair, him, his watch. The wife sells her hair in order to buy a watch chain for her husband's watch. Her husband sells his watch in order to buy combs for his wife's hair. When they exchange gifts on Christmas, they realize that both of their gifts are now useless. However, they've demonstrated the lengths they're willing to go to in order to show their love and appreciation for each other. Of all of the reasons to give gifts at the holidays, the best ones are to remember and appreciate the people we love. And now at NPM, we work to preserve those gifts for future generations. And many of them can be seen and appreciated in the streets of Old Milwaukee.